Hey everyone, welcome to race number one of season one. We're here at Slippery Slopes for the Sonic GP. Make your way down the ramps, look out for those boulders, and see who can make it to the finish first. Now, very first race of the season. We'll have a quick check now over at the teams that we've got for the season. So last week we had our qualifying race where we determined the eight teams for the season. We had Team Dark and Team Chaotix unfortunately not make the cut, but they will be back for next season replacing the bottom two uh, teams for this season. So we'll see how everything goes. we we'll jump straight into the racing. Very first race, we're getting ready to go green. Ready, set, go! Away we go. First race of the season here at the Slippery Slopes. We'll see who's going to be making some good gains. So we got to Carl. First one out of the uh, Pachinko machine. Followed by Manic and Big. Pretty close behind. Putting a bit of a battle there for second place. Meanwhile, to Carl has a nice little gap to the uh, rest of the field. I say that, but she's lost a whole bunch of time there, running into the uh, little wacky, waving, um, inflatable pole things. Meanwhile, we got Chow at the front. Our camera is having a bit of trouble keeping up. We will go into leader cam, just so we can try and get back to where the action is. So Manic has made a really good move down the funnel. Meanwhile, Tails. Trying to catch up there in second, decides to go around the outside. Sonic follows suit. So we got Manic, Tails, Sonic, Metal Sonic. It looks like Metal Sonic has a good bit of speed here. It looks like he might actually catch up to Sonic. Manic continues to be out in front. There is some debris on the track, I've heard. And uh, we're going to see how the racers can handle it. Looks like Manic will be the first one to come up to the debris. So it's not always a benefit to be out in front, although Manic seems to... Oh, nope, no, I spoke too soon. Manic has just been caught up. Oh my, Metal Sonic with the beautiful pass around the outside. Everyone else was stuck on that debris. Metal Sonic just said, I'll just be making my way through here. Looks like Metal Sonic getting a bit stuck on these spikes. Tails, a very nice move into the, into the lead. We've got three different paths you can take here. The middle path is always the quickest path to take. Oh, Tails getting slowed down by the rest of the field who also decided to take the middle path. Now, the main reason why the middle path is the best path to take is because when we get to the end, you'll see it's a nice straight shot, whereas the left and right paths, they have a bit of an angle you're going to have to work with. So, Manic, I think Tails was in the lead, but, yep, so... Once they all make their way down here, it looks like Tails should be back out in front. In fact, Tails has a bit of a gap there. So as you can see, the guys that took the right puff had a bit of a trouble there. They ran into the wall. Meanwhile, Tails taking that middle puff, just a nice straight shot straight through all that obstacle. And now he's up the elevator, getting close to the end of the race. We just have a couple of intersections to get through and then there's the long jump there at the finish now you got to be careful to take this jump correctly otherwise all that hard work will just end up not paying off just like that tails fails to do the jump and he is out of the race sonya also failing to make the jump we're at can somebody make this jump nope chow also failing to do it looks like it is orbiting cubot so even though they were not at the front, they were the first ones to actually make that jump. So Manic, Wave, and Sonic, your next ones to come across. Looks like Metal Sonic gets fifth. We're losing a few of the racers. They're just not quite getting that jump properly. Blaze falls a bit short. Chaos also able, unable to get there. Here comes Grounder. Looks like he's gone off to the right there. Looks like Big will round out the top ten. Who else we got still coming? So Carl, who actually started out in the front right at the beginning of the race, is now the last one to come down. See if we can find her. 
There she is, so she's about to come down the slide. So will she get the jump? Uh, looking like she's gonna miss, and she does. So, Orbot and Cubot get the win! Well done to the little robots. So, 24 racers, only 15 actually getting to the finish line there. Orbot and Cubot doing a good job, and teammate Metal Sonic in fifth as well. It's a good start for Team Eggman. Meanwhile, we've got a few DNFs here, Tails, unable to make it, and there's a few others down there as well. So, congratulations to our three podium finishers, Wave, Manic, and Orbot and Cubot, winning the top prize. We'll have a, now, uh, we'll have a look now at the standings. Obviously, individual standings are going to be pretty much as you expect. It's the first race, so it's basically how everyone finished. You can see a good chunk of people not finishing that race. Only 15 getting to the line, so a good 9, I believe. Yeah, good 9 people not finishing. And up front, Orbot and Cubot with their first place finish there. Manic with the second, and Wave with the third. Meanwhile, we'll have a quick check at the team standings. This is where things will be a little bit more interesting. So Team Eggman with a good start. 60 points is a pretty good haul for, for a race. So they also got that win with uh, Orbot and Cubot getting that first place. Team Rose in second, 45 points. So they're a good 15 behind. And then Team Underground in third with that second place finish by Manic. So they're only five points behind Team Rose. And if we look down to the bottom end of the field, we've got Team Babylon and Team Adventure both in the danger zone. Of course, it's only the first race of the season. But if they end up there at the end of the season, they're, then, uh, they're not going to be in for next season. So they want to try and do a little bit better next time. Team Adventure, of course, didn't get a single point. So they got a lot of work to, to get back into it. Let's so have a look here. You can see all our teams and how everyone went. Team uh, Eggman getting that good 60 points. And then Team Rose was the next with 45. Seven more races still to go, of course. Plenty of time for people to get back in. An early DNF isn't the end of the world, but of course, getting as many points as you can is always the aim of the game. So we'll see how it all goes. Team Eggman with a good start here. We'll be seeing if anyone can track him down. Orbit and Cubot getting that win. It's always good to bag yourself a few extra points by getting first, second, or third. Because as you'll, as you'll notice in the points, the way it works is uh, every position gets you an extra point until you get into third, second, and first, where it then starts to increase and you get a little bit more for your effort. So that will be it though for this race. Be interesting to see how everyone goes in the next one. But until then, have a good one. <laughs>